At a local bar, troopers are checking for IDs. This is the first year they're actually going inside as they've teamed up with the Alcoholic Beverages Law Enforcement Commission. But a lot of people will start earlier and be driving from destination to destination, uh, so to speak, bar hopping or party hopping. Law enforcement officials are talking with bartenders and checking patrons out, making sure they're not being overserved. They're also on the road looking for odd driving behaviors and traffic violations in hopes of catching drunk drivers. Officials say there are 108 fewer fatal accidents this year compared to last, which is a record for this decade. They say they're trying hard to safeguard that number. It doesn't take much for uh, someone who's intoxicated to uh, to strike a pedestrian or another vehicle that pulls out in front of them because their reaction times are, are uh, obscured. But officials say they're trying to prevent those drunk drivers from even getting on the road in the first place, which is one reason why they have extra patrol. While those in the ABLE Commission are usually undercover at bars, officials say tonight it's important that they're seen as a deterrent to drunk drivers. Them going in with us in uniform is... Uh, so that the public sees them, sees us, knows that we're out tonight in full force and effect. Officials say they will continue the patrol until 3 a.m. Asia Vickers, 2 News, works for you.